Hello everyone, this is a lesson number 11 and we are going to start about a Gaganyan mission. As you know very well like Gaganyan is not a new topic, always have a news but time to time have a lot of updations on the Gaganyan mission. So in the last month have some new updation of the Gaganyan mission. The one updation is like that earlier the target year of Gaganyan was 2020-22 and now the project is even got delay for 2020-23. And how this whole the entire Gagan mission now will make successful all the entire integrated study I will do here that will connect from the Gaganyan and see this entire topic is connected with the science and tech and I told you guys and you people know very well all the entire science and tech and environment current updates with all the videos I am coming here on the Unacademy YouTube platform. So stay tuned with me with all the current updates of the science tech and environment guys. So let us start uh, before going to start this lesson I would like to introduce myself. My name is Dr. Ravi Agrari. I have done my PhD from IIT Delhi. I'm working as a director of Pravanchala is at Gorapur where I'm providing the face-to-face -face classes. All the Delhi based teachers and faculties are available at one place. I'm taking your classes of science, tech and environment. From last 18 years, I'm in this UPSC teaching and thousand plus selection already happened under my guidance. I have published two books on the Megra Hill. The one is on science and tech and second is on environment book. These are highly selling book of India right now. So it's a telegram channel where you people can find out my all the entire PDF. And a part of this, all the video link, I also share you guys. So it's a single, yeah, overall I can tell you guys, it is a stop solution, one single stop solution for all of you for the entire update of science and environment that play a very important role in your examination. On the Sun Academy profile, my classes are available on plus. Plus is the paid courses, I hope you guys know very well. And the other one is a special classes. Special classes are free for all of you. For these all the courses, all the classes, you people stay tuned with me on Academy profile. My Academy profile is on academy.com oblique at Ravi P. Agrari 2010. So stay tuned with me and follow me here guys for the all entire classes. My code is Ravi UPSC during joining any courses. If you are using it, you will get extra 10% discount in your free stipend. So it's India's best educator platform for all of you for UPSC, CSC and all the experienced faculties of an academy. Even for whole throughout the whole India guys, they are available in the live session on an academy. So it's a great opportunity for all of you to stay tuned with all the experienced faculties under the live session on an academy. Even my all the entire classes are also available of science tech environment here. So it's an academy civil services championship, India's biggest prelims based national scholarship test that will held on the March 27th. So don't forget it guys, here you will get a lot of opportunity to win a lot of the scholarship and the prizes. So can you enroll now and the link is given below. A free and comprehensive interview guidance program for UPSC CSE 2021 is going to start right now. Last year 170 plus toppers been selected throughout the year, uh, last year guys, all the toppers and see it's a free for all the eligible aspirants. So those guys are going for UPSC interview in 2020-21. So stay tuned with us and we are providing the best and best panel, even the mentors for all of you for this interview program and it's all the, you know, the mentors name you people know very well. Mock interview starts on the first week of April. So hurry up and register now. Don't wait. An Academy Light, as here we are providing you the prelims, Jana studies, and CSAT test with all of you for the target year of 2020, 22, and 2023. Six month and one year subscriptions both are available now. 50,000 plus enrollment already has done on an Academy. To sh people have shown the interest to join an Academy for test series. So science and technology, the news. The current updates of Gaganyan mission. What about the updates I'll do here, guys? And see, what about the updates in the past month? The you here here you'll get a like Union Ministry of Science and Technology said the India's human space mission Gaganyan now it will launch by 2023. And let it target year was 15th August 2022. Before this date, India will make a history, will make a history to send the human in the space successfully and with the success of this india will become the fourth nation in the world after us russia and china so i hope so that india will make some records at international level and india will have a, a even in that categories of the nations like those even send the human in the space safely how this entire entire project will complete how the entire gagan project Gaganyan project will complete actually here the first uncrewed missions okay the first uncrewed mission that of Gaganyan Gaganyan. Uh, it's a it's a possibility to be launched by second half of 2022 means in this year okay the first uncrewed mission means no crew member will be there it's a first trial second uncrewed mission with with one of the women robot that is called geometra will be at the end of 2022 so two uncrewed mission will be there in the one uncrewed mission no geometra the second uncrewed mission have some women robots even also use there 
that is the second and the third the final is the first crewed mission and final will be what under the three under the three uh, order guys the third order will be the finally the crew member will send there okay so before sending a crew member first of, first of the two patients i want to send to make some study like we are making it successful or not reason in the case of this is a human being is going guys and people cannot take a single chance and that is the reason before the send a crew mission yeah human in the space we want to do two trial again i repeat first is the uncrewed second is the uncrewed with a biometra is a robot and third is totally planned with a crew mission and that crew mission will launch by 2023 and this is the reason in 2020-23 is the target right now now this 2020-22 is being delayed as 2020-23 gaganyaan mission is a demonstration of the human space flight and where 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 have a uh, even the astronauts will go the answer is a low earth orbit Low Earth orbit, I spoke in you earlier, guys. In the case of space technology chapter in the static parts, even a few people have read my science and technology book of fifth edition. Those are available in the market. Okay, the Magra Hill platform that my book published. I mentioned that the low Earth orbit means the distance around fifty kilometer to two thousand kilometer from the Earth surface. But here the distance will be around four hundred five hundred kilometer from the Earth surface. And definitely, guys, four hundred five hundred kilometer will come under the range of fifty to two thousand kilometer. Okay. A part of this program, two unmanned missions and one manned missions will be approved even by government of India. You already know very well. In this entire project, the total expenditure is roughly around ten thousand crore. The better you remember, around ten thousand crore. This is the total expenditure. Those those India have planned in the case of Gaganyaan mission. So roughly is nine thousand two twenty three and uh, even exactly nine thousand twenty three is official data and ten thousand crore. Roughly you people remember, guys. Okay, in the purpose of this entire the uncruise mission is what? What is the purpose of we went to send the uncruise mission? Basically, we want to check the technology. We want to check the safety. We want to check the reliability. So for this, all the entire verification and crew missions are very very important to check it, guys. Again, I am going to repeat, guys, because crews are going and life is going. So we people cannot take a single risk. The technologies that will mainly require for the Gaganyaan. mission you people can see here guys what kind of technology is required human rated launch vehicles so definitely a launch vehicle are have a ability to carry the human being okay even the satellite in the space so this time is the human is going to definitely we must have to be a uh, human rated launch vehicles okay the one part the crew escape system is also very important suppose sometime have some casualty or some uh, difficulties even going to happen in the space guys okay so definitely the crew escape system should also be equipped in the launch vehicle that in the emergency condition further the further the satellites or crew member can come back toward the earth third one is a habitable orbital modules so definitely those module will go upside okay with the astronauts guys it should be habitable and possibility of life should be there third fourth one is a life support system how the how the how the uh, astronaut will survive okay all the experiment is also very important part and the next one guys the crew member selection its training and associated with the crew management activities so that is also the part of this gaganyaan project to make it successful so these are the five main important technologies are very very important and whenever we will train with the five technologies we develop this technology through the help of various innovations so definitely this gaganyaan project will become successful see one thing more guys overall program coordination system engineering implementation a lot of things a lot of things are going to carry by isro overall the everything behind all the gaganyaan budget isro is behind it okay and see here one thing more guys lot of the uh, industries lot of the academics and national agencies they are working they are participating in the case of gaganyaan project so gaganyaan i have spoken you guys that it is a integrated work with the various academics various industries and national agencies even private players are also helping to the country to make it uh, even the success successful uh, this gaganyaan project see guys one thing more astronaut trainees are selected okay that is also a very great uh, you know uh, question here and especially those uh, trainee will select here they will be a uh, pilots air force pilots and selection criteria jointly defined by the isro and indian air force okay indian air force definitely what about the medical condition everything the physio uh, phy psychology a lot of things even work together what about the flying experiences what about the fitness of the people okay on that basis the air air force pilot will decide and in the case of gaganyaan project guys a lot of collaboration partners 
especially those are working especially for the gaganyan project to make it successful i would like to read out all the all the joint partners collaborating partners the one is the indian armed forces the second is the defense research development organization third is the indian maritime agencies that is the indian navy indian coast guard shipping corporation of india national institute of oceanography the fourth one is national institute of ocean technology fifth one is the indian meteorological department sixth one is the csir lab and second one is the academic institutes and eighth one is the industry partners so these are the eight collaborating partners are actually the part of gaganyan project they will work with the gaganyan project now what about the vyomitra the vyomitra you you will know very well the second and crew mission will carry the vyomitra and vyomitra is a first first female humanoid robot that is developed by isro and see the vyomitra is very very important in the trial basis reason it will monitor module parameters alert astronauts and perform life support operations through the help of vyomitra all the experiment will become possible actually guys you know what actually here how the astronauts will do work inside the shuttle or inside the space craft your launch vehicles okay through the help of vyomitra trial we are trying to find out the answers okay that how we will alert the astronauts okay uh, whatever life support operation it will work there everything we want to check through the vyomitra is a kind of dummy that we are doing and definitely guys in the next time human is going so we want to see that what about the activities of the human that they will perform inside the inside the shuttle guys we want to check it and it will check through the help of the robots because robots have no life and through robots we will do and robot is what it is a kind of artificial intelligence artificial intelligence is a kind of machine that will work like to the human brain on the basis of performance accuracy and reliability so definitely this machine even we have to prepare the isro has prepared under the trial purposes to check about the activities of the astronaut what will be inside the shuttle guys so it is stimulate the exact human function in the space that is very very important before india's first human flight mission guys vyomitra will make a solo trip to space as part of the test flight that will undertaken ahead of the ambitious launch to the to the to the uh, in the even even very very simple guys to make astronaut life safe and secure it's a gaganyan you will can see guys recently in the uh, mpbsc examination a question you psc asked gaganyan uh, sorry uh, vyomitra is developed by the answer was simple isro Okay, but it was very direct questions that UPSC made. What about the significance of the Gaganyaan project? Simple guys, it will help the progress India. It will help a progress that India towards a sustained and affordable human and robotic programs. The one one, one part. Second one is the advanced technology capability that India will attain. Third one guys, definitely the future cap capability will enhance and a part of the various collaborates. Okay, in the coming future that India can do. employment generation is also there and collaborate means definitely india will connect with the various other research institutions for the some more work and all in the coming future lot of the academics and industries they will be the partnership with the isros and all even it will inspire the new generations that we have also one more options to go and do the work in the space research and all and a part of the strengthening the international partnership in the global security okay and of course india will also be become a member of space club as there is a lot of opinions okay what about the way forward definitely guys after being a successful of the gaganyaan mission india will try to start the india space station that will be the 20 ton mass guys and 20 ton is around 20000 kg the mass a huge mass india will try to make it successful okay but this all the entire work will start india will start after the success of gaganyaan mission guys indian space station will be platform for conducting the scientific industry research further further in the space guys in micro gravity environment So in micro gravity environment, if you want to do an experiment, or definitely Indian space station will be the one of the worst, worst, uh, even the best options. Because whenever you are going to set up, it, what is the space station actually? Space station made video. I'll make one of the videos later on. But one thing I'll tell you, it is a kind of a space laboratory. And this is a space laboratory. Those we are going to set up at the height of 400, 500 kilometer from the surface in the Leo orbit. And here in the micro gravity environment, we want to do various experiment. And see at last, guys, this is the Telegram channel. I will. suggest to all of you guys kindly go and download all the entire pdf here see if you are in all the video channels all the video links are also given here so you you go and take it an academy profile available an academy.com oblique at ravi tiger hit 2010 here all the an academy profiles are available and here i suggest to all of you guys for my uh, plus classes iconic courses those are paid and even the special classes those are free for all of you you people can join here and follow me on under an academy.com oblique at ravi ravi p agradi 2010 my code is ravi upsc during jani any courses you must have to use it you will get extra discount this is the best uh, course for all of you as a iconic subscriptions in the iconic subscription one of the live mentorship help you will you will get it at support at tutor will connect within the live 
classes and all question answer practices even this type of exercises you will you can get it study planning how to do what to do everything you can take a support from the live uh, educators and see a part of this open house with the educators also there very neat type of faculties even you people will get the opportunity to call them and connect them very easily an academy subscriptions of the plus and iconic both are available for the general studies okay and whenever you are using the ravi upsc code extra 10% discount you will get either you are taking a general studies courses or you are using the optional courses 10% discount available both two places it's a 0% emi to date that we an academy is providing you regarding anyone have a financial problem happen then academy also providing you the loan facility with 0% emi so it's a great for all of you guys regarding those students even suffering with the financial problems as it then academy have a best rating right now that you can see on the screen guys and earners enrolled around 50000 in an academy test series i see one thing more guys how how an academy is different with the other one we are not only providing the courses a part of we are providing the printed comprehensive notes 20000 plus questions on the practice session mcq based crash courses and the live mentorship so everything everything are available also on the an academy that made an academy different from the other platform and it's a good news for all of you guys now an academy is also on your doorstep and now the physical appearance of one academy is also available at old rajendra nagar near metro pillar 1 to 1 delhi where all the faculties are coming there on our the slot basis guys and we are connecting with the students regarding their own doubts and discussions so it's a courses of science and tech and environment those are already running now science and technology one session already over and the environment the next session is uh, even the first session is going on so for plus courses you people can stay tuned with me on an academy is a upsc csc batches and that is going to start from 23rd march 2020 2022 it's a one year session and in this one year session for the bilingual and the english courses both are available here you will get the all the entire books that is uh, required for your entire preparations so thank you everyone and then the last i'll suggest to all of you guys kindly subscribe the channels can kindly like and share this entire videos to your friend also and see directly go and download this pdf from my telegram link that i told you guys and at last be happy take care of yourself God bless you. Jai. Yeah.